Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who haven't known me, my name is CT Ray and I will be sharing with you this DIY project using air dry clay and um, it's very easy, it's very fun. I really really love how it turned out. Be creative, have fun and enjoy doing this air dry clay um, DIY. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and don't forget to like, share, Here's what you'll need for this DIY project. An air dry clay, a rolling pin, a chopping board, knife, baking paper, a little bit of water, and also a painting brush. So start off by flattening the clay with a rolling pin. You can go ahead and place a baking paper underneath before rolling the clay for a smooth surface. I did not do that because I totally forgot, but thank god my chopping board has a smooth and clean surface so it didn't affect the clay. To make the base, I'm just going to draw an oval shape and cut it out using a knife. Remove the axis but put it on the side because we will use that for the line art. So here I'm just going to take a little bit of water to smoothen the edge because there was a little bit of a crack. Then I'll be putting that on the side so it drives off a little bit. So now I'll be using these axes for the line art. Using my fingers, I'll be rolling these into long snakes. You'll need to make around 7 of these. Make sure to have one of them thicker and longer because we'll be using that to place around the edge of the plate. Now the fun begins. First off, you'll need to wet the edge of the plate with water and then attach the snake around it. Take a painting brush and again, using water, blend and smooth them up. You can also use your fingers. So I took out my phone with the line art that I want and traced them exactly like the picture. I have to say it was really tricky, but just be creative, move around and adjust with your fingers. I started off with the body part before doing the face and then I just cut the axis out. Again, using a painting brush, just smooth the edge and that is also a way to attach the line art to the plate. Now that I've already done the body part, which takes me about 15 minutes, um, I managed to do the whole figure and features. I really, really love it. This is the outcome. Don't forget to smoothen the edge and surface with water and then leave it to dry for 24 to 48 hours. This is my first attempt with air dry clay. Um, I'm actually proud of myself, okay? Y'all better appreciate this. So here I'm just creating a small tassel. And when I'm done with that, I'll just attach it to the plate. I really love it. You can use this as a decor or you can easily put your accessories on it. For my next DIY project, you'll need a black pepper, your choice of bowl as a mold and also a cling wrap. Cutting out a piece of the clay and flatten it as thinly as you can, not too thin because it will easily break. Then take the black pepper and just spread it around and take your rolling pin and roll it out so it'll stick to the surface. Fold it and repeat it again and again and again. By now you'll feel like you're competing in MasterChef, showing off the Italian side of you, you know? Until you're happy with the outcome, just roll it, flattening it again as flat as you can. Just not too flat because you don't want to break it, just enough to cover your mold. Wrap the cling wrap around your mold and then place the clay on top of it. You can go ahead and press it down gently until you're happy with the shape. Be 
because I had a little bit of a crack on the side so I took a little bit of water to just smoothen the surface and the edges just tear off the edge to give that leaf sculpture look to it Again, taking some water using my fingers to just smoothen the edges and surface and also tear off the edges a little bit more until I'm happy with the outcome. Now you can just leave this to dry for 24 hours. Once it dries off, I took a toothbrush and dip it with gold paint and flick around it. I also paint around the edge of this bowl. I really really love the look of this bowl. It's very very beautiful. So there you have it, your teared leaves culture bowl. Remember when we tear off the edge of the bowl? Don't throw that away because we'll be using that for our third DIY project. So I took a little bit of a grey colored clay, mixing it together with the leftovers to create a marble look for this third DIY project. Roll it into a ball and just press it down using the rolling pin, just flatten it out. Until you're happy with the shape that you want and you can just leave it to dry it for 24 hours. If you have a used toilet paper, you can use it for this DIY project. Or if you don't, you can just get something similar at a DIY store. So after I painted the whole thing gold, you can paint whatever color you like. I poke a hole in the middle using my scissors to be able to push the stick through. With the clay, I made a hole using the stick so we can glue them down later. I use this to hang my accessories and watches. I also put few beads to make it look more glamorous. So here's how it looks. I hope you guys enjoy it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.